Hi everybody and welcome back. Well, it's lovely to have you all back here again today. And today we are comparing two little beauties. I'm gonna give you a full review on this little baby that I bought recently and revealed to you. She is the Mila Clutch in the Louis Vuitton and compare her to the beautiful Pochette Accessoire, the Takashi Murakami print. And I'll give you size comparisons and all the rest. So let's jump in. Hi everybody and welcome back. It is lovely to have you all back here again and to all my new subscribers, you are so welcome. I hope you love it here and to my old subscribers, how are you doing? I hope you're all doing well. I know it's still tough out there and a lot of people are still in lockdown so I hope I'm bringing you a little bit of entertainment and we can keep each other company and a lot of you are asking me questions down below so chat away and we'll all get each other through this. So I just wanted to share with you first of all, oh my god, I got through that disaster of nearly a full on fire in my last video. It was just, it wasn't funny, but it was funny because we were all right. Like I was showing it to Katie and she was, she was actually in the pisses laughing at me. She's like, it's actually growing out of your head. And I was like, I know. So thank God I've cleaned up all the mess that was here. I've taken the candle and just moved it away from everything. And it just goes to show you can't be too careful, even though I'm pretty careful and watch candles all the time, so just be careful. So thank God we're all fine. And apart from that, I wanted to share my new fragrance with you and it is called Side Effect from Inicio Parfum. This only came in today and I just want to show you the packaging. It is purple and it is beautiful and it comes with the velvet. This is how it opens. I was going to do an unboxing, but that's not why you're here. So just a quick, absolutely beautiful. This is of course oriental. It's vanilla. There's rum in it and uh, I sprayed some on earlier, so I don't know what I'm going to smell like, but anyway. It is stunning. I've been waiting to get this one for a while. It is rather expensive, as I said. It's boozy, spicy, tobacco, vanilla, uh, cherry, cinnamon, rum. Uh, the longevity, longevity is forever and the sillage is enormous. It's unisex and as it's sweet and on the end then it is powdery. It is stunning, stunning. If any of you are looking for a new fragrance, a special occasion for sure. A beaut. So the first one, as I said, is my Mila Clutch, which I got pretty new and I got to, cut to replace my beautiful Mila Clutch up here in the Takashi Murakami. So as we know, it was left behind in a taxi, stolen, I don't know, all of the above, whichever, but anyway, it's gone. So I really, really miss that bag. And I'll tell you why. I took her out that night, we went for dinner, obviously before everything that happened, and she's just a real, I'm gonna do mod shots and how what fits and all that kind of stuff, comparisons between the two of them, but she's a throw on your shoulder like that. And actually, even when I was going out and in the taxi, I was like, God, you wouldn't even feel that on, on your shoulder. So you have to be careful, you know, she'd actually slip off and she's so light, but like so convenient. That's what I loved about her. So yes, I will be doing, you know, how to wear them with mod shots, size comparison, what fits, so stick around. And comparing her to this beauty, which is the Pochette Accessoire in the Takashi Murakami. Now, I have been thinking, as you would have seen in other videos, of letting this one go, purely because I've, you know, other things in mind. Um, I'm not sure yet, but if anyone's interested, just DM me on Insta. So, the Mila Clutch, which is stunning, and why I love her so much, is because of the Vachetta that's around here. The way this bag is finished, um, they just don't, they just don't make them like that anymore, as they say. <laughs> so she's a little beaut um, with the uh, the trim, the Vachetta trim, and then the beautiful gold detail. It's just a lot thicker than what they are, what we are getting now and what they are making. This beautiful Rolo chain on it. I love it. And the loop there. And you cannot detach this as it's attached at the end there. But it is a stunner. And look at the gold detail again on the end. Just the brass is beautiful. And I love the brass here on the front, the bar across. I just love it. I love the size of this. It's a beautiful, multi-purpose little pochette. You can use it as a shoulder bag, as you saw. You can use it as a catch-all in a bigger tote. It's just a really good size. It fits your phone. I'll show you in a second. And just to mention, these straps, as you know, I have a thing for these straps. And I'm just gonna bring this one out just to show you. I have this one here, which is quite similar, that I bought myself, that I use for this little honey, this little cutie. And um, she attaches with the little lobster claws there at the bottom. They are quite similar. And I just want to tell you, the one on the top, and this one I did get from Organize My Bag, 
but I am now expecting a beautiful delivery from a company I'm collaborating with who are Dress Up Your Purse and they have kindly given me a discount code for you beautiful ladies and gents and it's down below. So grab that, get your beautiful chains. They have all different types. They've leather, they've everything. They've all these gold, silver, everything. Just have a look and use your discount code as some people already have and they let me know. So I just love to get the most out of my handbag and with this is a shoulder strap, but they do beautiful crossbody, much longer longer straps as well and I'm definitely definitely going to be get, getting one of those so as I said this one is well this one is eight inches across by four inches at the top here and I'm just going to show you what fits inside there she is beautiful with that gorgeous microfiber in the beige on the inside there and she has a little slip pocket here and then on the front there if you can see the actual stamp is Louis Vuitton Paris made in France this piece and why I'm always telling you to look on the pre-loved market was never ever worn and she's a vintage piece and I got her for a great price so I was delighted with that price comparison between these two this one as you know is a, a coveted item let's just say people love this one she's vintage she's a beauty and she's had obviously a huge massive resurgence in the last year or two so this one is going for more up around the thousand euro kind of mark and even above actually if you look on ebay or vestia people are trying to it depends on the condition of the bag so to see what fits inside here um i have the iphone 11 pro or plus i'm not sure which or maybe it's the 12 but anyway it fits with like two fingers here left over and then i have my ysl card holder and that's really all you fit a key in there as well but that is just beautiful and handy and as i said anything that holds my phone or you know i'm sure a lot of us are the same is an absolute winner she's a beautiful beautiful little piece i really love her and I, as i said it's the, the the hardware that gets it every time for me on this little pouch and inside as you can see i have my phone with my cover on it and my cards from YSL there, the little pouch with the coin uh, coins inside. And if I didn't want to bring this, I could just bring my little Bastia coin purse inside there. And this time just put the key, could do that. And let's see how that goes. We close her up, there they are all inside. And again, no problem at all. So she fits about, I suppose, three pieces. I mean, if the, depending, obviously three like as I said that's the Bastia somebody asked me actually one of my subscribers asked me does the Bastia coin purse fit a credit card do you know what that was a great question it's something that um Hermes should actually look at because you know what it's just a tiny bit short just a tiny bit so I have at the moment I have little my ear pods inside but look what I had, co had coins in it the other day so it just depends what you want to use it for so that's that loving the color and the pop of color inside my bag but just love the fact that this little pouch holds my phone and the how you know the different sizes because this is the bigger size there's another size that it has two Louis Vuittons on it so it's a lot smaller so I uh, make sure if you want the one that fits your phone that it has the three Louis Vuittons across here and that's how you know and that is the eight by four that is the size you're looking for and again the beautiful um, zip just the quality of the hardware there is no wearing on any of the hardware there's no tarnishing or fading or anything like the new hardware that we're getting at the moment so that's that little piece if you're lucky you I it's about seven and eight hundred it's going for on secondhand sites you can be lucky if you push them you might get it for five so it's worth knowing that and then moving on to this little beauty well just to compare it the two in size as you can see this one is obviously bigger so i will just give you a look at the two of them so the height of the pochette accessoire is a, i suppose it'd be a good inch above the mila clutch and then in length it's probably another inch longer if you can just see there you go so just measuring them up and you can see the difference there and then side by side again the pochette accessoire has about an inch and this one is just much thinner but it does open out as you saw so you're gonna you're definitely gonna fit a whole lot more in this one this one is hugely hugely popular and people are loving it i particularly love this color combination the pink the white and the green and that's what was on my previous mila clutch 
and that is the one I wanted again. I know there's beautiful blues and purples, but this is the combination I wanted. Mine is in really, really good nick. Look, at I have my little PM agenda inside, the cuteness of these two together. They're just so cute. Actually, that, I want to check, does that fit into this? I'm not sure if it does. Let's have a look now, just as I found her there. No, that is too tall for the Mila clutch. So that's that out. So now, if that is a decision maker for you, but she definitely fits absolutely no problem. And again, just to have a look at the beautiful microfiber lining inside, not a mark, just perfect, luxuriously feel, uh, feel to it and just beautiful. I've taken off the strap off this one because I want to show you for the purpose of the video. And this is the strap that it comes with, the beautiful gold um, little studs on it and the strip of leather with the lobster claw there at the top, if you can see that. And so what I wanted to show you, because I like to wear my pochettes cross body, I took off the strap off my, uh, I took my strap off my Palm Springs Mini. And so this is it, as you know, you get two straps with your Palm Springs Mini. And so I like to make my handbags work and my straps work and be very versatile and to play. Love to play, I do. <laughs> and again, if you're into, uh, actually I did the video with the YSL Toy Lulu with eight different ways you could wear it with lots of different straps. That's a great video to watch, so have a look at that. Just really good for different ideas. But anyway, this, black strap is just perfect on this bag and I will be doing mod shots but it fits beautifully cross body just another variation and makes it so much more versatile and the black on black I think is beautiful but as I said I'd also love to wear the gold with this and get a cross body a long gold cross body which I'm going to get from dress up your purse definitely going to get that as an extra but in the meantime let me just show you the shorter one that I have um, which is really nice and you can wear it as a shoulder bag. So that's the beauty of these little pieces. They're just so versatile and easy, convenient and all the things that we like. Just link it on, so easy with the little lobster claw. And then you have a whole different looking purse and a whole different use for your purse. Look at that. Isn't she just so cute? And that is her then on your shoulder if you wanted a bigger bag to the Mila clutch. And this, of course, and absolutely fits your phone and all the rest of it because it is nine inches across, which is one inch longer than the Mila clutch and five inches tall and then about one inch wide here in depth. So inside you have my phone, of course, the iPhone 11. Pro. Look at how much room, just masses of room inside here, no problem at all. Sure, let's bring the, the mini agenda, PM agenda, you never know what notes or ideas I might come up with. I like the old fashioned way of jotting things down. I do use my phone as well time to time, but I do like to write. And what else will we throw in here? This could just, we'll throw in my YSL card holder and we will put in a lip gloss and we'll put in my key and let's see should we just keep going all together we'll put in the bastia coin purse because today we're using it for my airpod or not my airpods but yeah my airpods you know what i mean so we will close that all up and let's have a look look at that not a bother and the more i pack into it and the more i do videos like this the more i want to hold on to it because it really is actually beautiful and practical and with all those colors would go with so many. Now, I, I mean, you could put, you could change it around, put your six ring key holder in here, put your little Louis Vuitton round purse if you didn't want to bring the other items or stick a pair of sunnies in the top. And I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna take a couple of items out here because that's how many, one, two, three, four, five, six. Look at that. I mean, that's, that's a handbag and a half. That is a great mini bag, it really is. So I'm gonna take out the Bastia coin purse and take out my key. And I'm going to, let me see, I take out this because I mean, I wouldn't really bring that when I'm bringing a mini bag. And so we put in the glasses on top. There you go. And 
my sunnies and the whole lot are inside there. So a really, really good little bag, as I said, for anybody who's thinking about getting this. Um, I would recommend it, definitely just haggle a little bit, obviously getting her either on eBay, be careful and be cautious if you're getting her on Vestia or Fashion File, Rebag or Yogi's Closet, they authenticate, which is absolutely brilliant. Which would I recommend? Well, it really depends on how much you carry, to be honest. I mean, both are stunning. I love the gold straps on them. This is lovely because you can take the strap off and put the longer crossbody one, but you can also attach a crossbody to this, like another gold chain, which would be lovely. It would be lovely. It'd be like the uh, multi pochette accessoire. And uh, so, yeah. And then, like, if you just want to even compare it to this little beauty, and we can wear those two together, there's another idea. The ideas are just endless. So... <laughs> Uh, you could definitely kind of put those link those two together. You can get links everywhere online, and there you have your own multi pochette. I know it's demi and monogram, but that is the size difference then there between the the mini and the Mila clutch. So until next time, mind yourselves, be kind, be safe, be compassionate. Love you lots. Mwah.